everyone. Welcome back. All right, I have some, well, I don't see, I don't own all the high-end ones, but I'm going to give you dupes for all of the chocolate bar palettes, because I now have all of them, and let's make a revolution, which they will drop some more on me. We'll have to get them. Okay. Uh, most of the dupes are for Too Faced and Urban Decay. Some I don't know. I did some homework last night online, and I could not find the dupes. There may be, they may be not. But for these prices, you can't beat it. And considering you can get these at Ulta and online and use your points and all that, get these. Save your money. Okay, the first one. I actually had to break it on a table because I have so much sitting over here. Two-faced two semi-sweet chocolate bar. Those run, what, like 50 bucks? Then you have the I Heart Makeup Salted Caramel. So this, I know, is a dupe for this because I've done swatches back in the day about it. Okay. Let's hope I don't drop either of these. But these are dupes, definitely. So you get Too Faced on the bottom, make a revolution on top, I'm going to drop these balance. <laughs> and I'm not a fan of the Too Faced shadows as it is. I have a lot of problems blending them and not my thing and I could care less that it smells like chocolate. I don't like scented products. It's really not my thing. So you want the dupe for that. So the semi-sweet chocolate bar is the salted caramel. Now for the chocolate bonbon palette you have the chocolate love palette. I haven't used this. I don't even think I've used the Too Faced one. That's funny. Okay. Too Faced on the bottom. Makeup Revolution on top. I'm blinding you to no end. There we go. But this is definitely a dupe. I was cracking up. One of my girlfriends is a diehard. Well, not anymore. <laughs> diehard Too Faced fan. So I sent her this and said, play with it against this. And she even had to admit of she liked the Makeup Revolution one better, <laughs> which was kind of funny. Okay, I just showed you in the other video the mint chocolate palette, which I have no idea if there's any dupes for, but this is a beautiful fall palette regardless. So you have that one in there. The Golden Bar Palette. Do I have anything on that one? I think it's a dupe for something, but I couldn't figure it out. But it's another just gorgeous palette. You will not be disappointed in the shades, anything like that. The payoff, the pigment, it's all there. Uh, this is the Pink Fizz Palette. I thought there was a dupe for this, but I couldn't find it online. I mean, they all don't have to be dupes, obviously. Okay, then we have Chocolate Vice, which is a black palette here. Why do I still have... That's gone now. Now, in my notes... See, I don't own the UD Smoky. This could be a dupe for that. Somebody online said it was. I'm not sure. But regardless, gorgeous palette. Uh, chocolate and peaches. Guess what this dupes? Too Faced Peach Palette. It's a dead on dupe. <laughs> but better quality, in my opinion. Okay. Then we have Death by Chocolate, which I don't own the Naked Palette. This is the dupe for the Urban Decay Naked 2. I mean, why pay $50 for a palette when you can pay less than $15? I'd rather have the dupe, personally. Okay. Uh, I think I just showed you in my haul the Chocolate Rose Gold. I'll show it to you again. Stunning. Possibly a dupe for the Huda palette. Uh, what else we got here? Naked Chocolate. 
I believe this is a dupe for the Urban Decay Naked, which I don't own. There's that one. Did I tell you this one already? Oh, no. This is, it's just called I Heart Chocolate. So it's a deeper color than, it's lighter than the Death by Chocolate. And it's darker than the Salted Caramel. But the I Heart Chocolate Palette is a dupe for the Too Faced Regular Chocolate Bar. So there's that one. Okay. I do own the Naked 3 from Urban Decay. Because I like those kind of rose colored shades. But you want a better dupe? Makeup Revolution. These are Redemption eyeshadow palettes. This is the Iconic 3. It dupes it, trust me. I've done the swatches. How are we going to get this one up here? Wait a minute. Definite dupes. Almost in the exact order, too. And they also have dupes for um, Urban Decay 1 and 2. So if you get, pretty simple to remember this, of uh, the Iconic 1 is a dupe for the Urban Decay. The Naked Palette. And then the iconic two would be the would be the dupe for naked two. I, mean, I never bought the Urban Decay first two palettes because how many neutral palettes do I really need? I don't know. I have ten million of them. I know. Uh, then there's another one here. This is the Neutrals. Then it, it's N E W T R A L S versus Neutrals. Here. It's got stickies on it from the back. So, so that's the name right there. Neutrals versus neutrals. So this has plain black packaging. That is this here. And some people have said this is a dupe for the ABH Modern Renaissance. Which, some of the colors do look really close, so it is a possibility here. Oh my god, look at that one. Ah, there we go. Similar, I, I don't, wouldn't say it's probably a 100% dupe. I mean, I haven't swatched them side by side. But again, you don't have to buy these high price palettes. There's just no reason. There's absolutely no reason. This is a gorgeous palette. And this is sold at Ulta. I mean, to me, of if I can buy, say they're, you know, 15 bucks a piece. You can buy three of these for $45 compared to one palette. So why would you ever pay for this? Why? To pay for the stupid name and, oh, the packaging? I, you, you've got to figure out by now. I can care less about the packaging. I have, it's what's in the packaging that matters to me. I'm not wearing the packaging. I'm wearing the shadow. So I want the shadows to perform. I can care less about what the box is. If it's cardboard, metal, plastic, made out of steel, iron, I don't care. I want the product inside to be good. Not just hyped up and, you know, overpriced for absolutely no reason at all. Okay. Um, I think I got them all here. So I currently have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Currently I have 11 palettes of these, of the chocolates. And they're worth it. I mean, totally, totally worth it. And like I said, if you want dupes for, you know, the naked one, two, and three, here you go. Makeup Revolution, Iconics. There's all three of them. Okay. I think that's all of them. Yes. All right. 
So hopefully that gives you some comparison. I mean, I can't sit here and swatch them all for you. That's just absolutely crazy. I know I've done back in the day, I threw up on Instagram swatches of like the, the chocolate bar palettes here side by side. And every, and I was laughing of you tell me which one is Too Faced and which one's, you know, the dupe. And the funniest thing is most people pick the dupe instead of the Too Faced, which I thought was quite amusing. So trust me, save some money, keep the money in your pocket and you know, just buy the dupe. Why not? And Makeup Revolution makes amazing products and there you just keep them coming. And like I said, if I woke up this morning and I turned it on, they have a bunch of new, like the Skin Kiss highlighters that are huge. They are massive. I'm just, I think I have one. I have the peach one. And they added in like eight more shades. I'm like, oh my God, I have to do another order, but I'm going to hold off on the next order because I'm sure he'll launch some more stuff soon. All right, everyone have a fabulous day. Phone was ringing, so I have to go see what that was about. All right, I'll see y'all soon. Bye.